All right, we are here on day two of the Bellagio Five Diamond main event alongside one of my favorite people in poker, Andrew Lucky Chewy Lichtenberger, who has final tabled this event three times in the past. Andrew, how is a potential fourth final table looking so far in your run? Uh, well, I'm below starting stack, so I guess from an objective standpoint, it doesn't look great, but I always feel good, and I tend to have great luck at the Bellagio, so yeah, I'm uh, still optimistic. Now, you're a Las Vegas local, so you have a little bit of the home field advantage here, but your greatest success so far this year was in a high roller, the 50K, down at the Seminole Hard Rock earlier this year. How much did you take down for that score? Uh, it was a bit over 600,000, and uh, yeah, it was an amazing experience. I think I played really well, and uh, I really like to play creative, inspired poker, and I, I brought that on, on that occasion, so it was awesome. And in one of the toughest fields that comes together over the course of a year, so you won 650000 in that, but we're going to have a seven-figure first prize in this event, so the potential to one-up yourself for a score this year. When you look around this field and you see so many of the best in the game, but also some recreational players, how does that affect your approach in a field like this? Yeah, it's a great question. Um, you know, when you compare it to a high roller field like the 50K down in Seminole, uh, you have to play a much more theoretically sound game. It's um, less so the case that you'll have the opportunity to really take advantage of your opponent's errors because everyone's quite solid. Here you get a complete different mix of styles and that allows you uh, yourself to, to mix it up quite a bit as well. So. Um, yeah, I would say I'm able to play even more creatively in a field like this. All right, well, speaking of those differing styles in play, you'll actually be teaching one of the upcoming Learn WPT seminars in early December at the Win, leading up to our World Champs event over at Win Las Vegas. Tell us a little bit about your conduct during those seminars and what you aim to teach to our students. Yeah, absolutely. So at the seminars that we do with Learn WPT, I really think it's helpful to share um, a very theoretical basis for one's game plan because in order to make adjustments off of that baseline, you have to understand what the baseline looks like. So once you kind of grasp roughly what that is, then you can start to become more creative on the felt and uh, yeah, really come into your own as a player, in my estimation. Well, as somebody who has worked and been alongside those seminars with you, I can vouch for what a great an articulate teacher Andrew is. So if you're in Las Vegas and you want to join us in early December, we'd love to see you there. Till then, I'll let you get back to your break and good luck in the Awesome. Thanks, man. You too. Take Thanks. care.